Hundreds of millions of dollars are going to parts of Omaha to bring jobs, housing and an economic boost. State senators are calling this a historic moment, but are there any set plans for how the money will be dolled out? 3 News Now reporter John Kipper set out today to find some answers on that. We recognize that we're not going to be able to social program our way out of our issues. Senator Justin Wayne took a business approach in passing the Omaha Recovery Act, pointing out the details and showing that what happens in North Omaha helps the rest of the state. Plenty agreed. That $4 billion of economic activity will be added to the Omaha region when North and South Omaha reach equity with the rest of the community. Wayne's plan worked and Governor Pete Ricketts formally signed the bill in North Omaha Thursday, investing around $250 million in a North Omaha and another 55 million to South Omaha. It's the first time the state is investing millions of dollars into our community. So where is this money going? Well, there's a process. Studies need to be done. Wayne says they're currently out recruiting businesses and there will be a formal application process come August. The bill aims to address affordable housing, help out small businesses, plus job training and economic development. But Willie Barney, who's been pushing for economic equity in North Omaha good for job. years, says they have good businesses, good programs, business initiatives right? in place already. Now they'll have a chance to boom. We've always talked about with a larger investment, we can really take it to scale. So we can see more businesses expanded, launched and scaled up. We can see more homes developed in the community. We can hire more youth. One part of the plan where there is specifics right now is they're looking to build upon the business park already here near Epley Airfield. One man said Thursday, He's looking to put his business here. We need the uh, good technical skills with a mind and a will to work. O.C. Combs Jr., owner of Pacific Engineering, a defense contractor outside Lincoln, has committed to put 100 jobs in the area of the airport business park. And we are looking to have a mixture of about 40 percent of our employees and future employees that will come from the North Omaha and South Omaha areas. With the bill passed, Senator Wayne says the work begins now with lofty goals in sight. When we talk about poverty in North Omaha, we talk about it with the past tense, that it's no longer a big issue like it is today. In Omaha, John Kipper, 3 News Now. Wayne credited the late state Senator Rich Pauls for fervently advocating for the plan and bringing on Republicans to support it.